So we just bought a nice little cabin in an incredible habitat filled with wildlife. So of course, we're gonna head out and shoot it all. <laughs> that is the goal of this game. The way of the hunter. Yes, let's begin part one. Uh, this could turn into a brand new series. I don't know. Um, it's a little bit quiet right now. And I thought, why not? This game just released yesterday. Let's check it out. Open world hunting game. We have a new cabin. Let's do it. Let's start this game. <laughs> oh, who's that? Oh no, I smell trouble. Wallace Elliott Whittle speaking. Hey Grandpa, I'm getting closer to the lodge. Your phone magically erased all the contacts again? River. Nurse Ellen was helping me with it, but she said she doesn't know how these old fashioned phones work. I'll help you with it when you return. Oh, I'm so grateful you decided to help me with the Bear Den Ranch. Competition is growing every day. Ethically hunted meat with government inspection? Sounds like a pretty niche market. Yeah, you'd be surprised. But the demand is rising every day. And with the hoax about the disease spreading... Uh, what? I can't hear you. River, can you hear me better now? Yep, way better. The service in the valley is really bad, so I'll make it quick. I've sent you a package a day ago, but I'm not sure when it will arrive. Just make yourself at home and maybe greet your old friend Echo. You know, it's been a while. Oh, God, I forgot about her. How long has it been? Ten years. I hope you didn't forget the keys. Oh, God, I did. What should I do? <laughs> Don't worry. The spare is in the usual spot. All right, I'm here. I'll call you later. And be nice to the nurses. Well, tell them to be nice to me. I'm always a gentleman. <laughs> and kiddo, or I guess I should start calling you River now. Welcome to the Ness Purse Valley. So was that ethical hunting, apparently? So we're, we're allowed to shoot. This is the legit. All right. Uh, we have objectives. No active missions selected as of the moment. Uh, we can move around. We can sprint. We can jump. There we go. Um, have heard a few complaints about the game. Uh, a lack of an FOV slider. I know that's a big factor for some people. Um, the game doesn't run perhaps as smooth as it maybe should. Uh, that's a few of the comments I've seen so far. The Bear Dan Ranch. So we can fast travel as well. There's a couple of question marks around. Okay. Whee! <laughs> you can now follow the story of River Knox and his grandfather. Or you can do whatever you are in the mood for and hunt for whatever you like. You can pick up the story again at any time. I think we should stick to the story, right? Yeah. I'm guessing, obviously, the main story is going to involve hunting, so I'm all for it. Let's do it. Oh, is this where the, speak the spec is? 
Thank God we have a trustworthy mailman. I just left the key in there. <laughs> you can't do that around here. At least where I live, anyway. All right, it's been we're a inside. Long time since I was here. Storing and equipping items, vehicle storage. Welcome to your new home, the Bear Dam Ranch. Here you can buy new items and equip them. When you are on the road and you need something, just open the trunk for your car. Of your car. Okay, got it. Is this our first weapon? Ooh. Grandpa's old raffle. Hunting tier four. Can I nick that? Yep, that is now equipped. Lovely. Oh, nice scope on it as well. I don't know if these are real scopes or real weapons. I don't I don't know yet. Oh, it is definitely ready. Reach the northwest balcony on the second floor. Okay, got it. So I can change my gear. Oh. They're quite cool animations. So I've got binoculars and my rifle. Go up to the next floor. I must admit, it's a very impressive den. Look at these stands. They're empty. We need to sort that out. Definitely. Yes, loads of stands here. Okay. Let's see what we can spot. What's down there? 400 meters away. Wow. Binoculars are hunter's best friend. First, cycle through your gear using the mouse, okay, to select the binoculars. To use them, press the left button, yeah. Some optics can be zoomed, so you can zoom in. These ones you can't. Uh, yeah, got it. So what are we looking for? Ah. There's the bridge. There's the mountain. Is that Echo? Your hunting map is still mostly unexplored. Venture beyond the bright areas with detailed information to expand your map view. Look for additional map pieces inside the cabin to uncover all points of interest. Okay, it is very uh, unexplored. Okay. Okay, it would definitely be advisable to open up the map, get the map fully revealed before we head out on random adventures. You've discovered Nisper's Valley grassland habitat. Okay. Open country for beginners and seasoned veterans alike. The meadows serve as prime feeding areas for both pheasants and badgers. Undisturbed grasslands with tall grass have the potential to hold a lot of small, but also some bigger game. That home is incredible. Like, it would be a bit spooky at night. Don't get me wrong. I just noticed that. Got the uh, the wind as well. Enter me car. Oh, we can do that. Yeah, what a home. Wow. Incredible. That view. Incredible view. We went to go and see a house the other day, and the view was just incredible out of the garden. Um, but, of course, the government was going to put houses there. Of course they were. Like a massive development. Humongous. I think there's 950 houses. I was like, oh. <laughs> of course. God forbid. Faster if I take a right turn. Take a right turn, got it. Car actually doesn't handle too badly. Ooh, got a little cockpit cam as well. Got a handbrake, could do a little handbrake turn. Should try it. Oh! Did you see that? I officially don't need need for speed anymore. Press E to get out of the vehicle. Got it. I think we're heading to that that bridge. Oh, I'm screw going around here at night. There's the bridge. I see it. Well, it's not indestructible. Okay, so I can damage it. Oh, yeah. Okay, to the left. Let me just go across. I think this is a crossing. <laughs> Humans have arrived. Oh, let's run one over. Oh! I was joking. Why did I do that? 
What? Why? What? Okay, I'm claiming it. <laughs> what the hell? What am I doing? Completely wasted. It's a, it's a road kill. All right, sure. I feel a bit bad. Each animal has a fitness value, which affects the animal trophy and size of the animal. Pay close attention, because you can change the average fitness of the habitat, ha habitat by hunting low trophy score males and vice versa. Okay, got it. Understand. That was um, yeah, not the ideal start to my hunting adventures. Let's see the car. Climb up the hill on foot, reach the ladder, and climb up. Oh, uh, that was a wolf. Should I, should I be walking now? Probably should, shouldn't I? I was just trying to get as close as I can. I would actually like gas to be a thing as well. I think that could be quite cool. I do have a feeling this is one of those sort of games where but they're probably going to do a fair amount of updates. Even though, even though the game isn't in early access, it sort of is in some ways. Um, well, we should uh, get out of here, I reckon. I don't think I was supposed to drive that far up, honestly, but I won't. Oh, her ladder. So far, I'm liking it. I am liking it. Definitely liking it. Oh, what's the uh, Here you are. hunter sense? Ooh. Okay. What's this? Greet echo. Ahoy! Whoa. Okay, it's just an echo. It's a literal echo. Okay. <laughs> that surprised me. Long time no see, my friend. Gee. All right. I did it. So now I can fast travel. If I want. So go to the map. Can we Yeah we can fast we can fast travel straight back. Let's do it. Does the car come with me? I hope so. Uh to zero at a long range. Press up. Okay. And to zero at a shorter distance, press down. While zooming with a scope, stabilize your sway while zoomed. Press shift. I guess, I'm guessing that's what it is. Most scopes can be zoomed in or zoomed out. All right, got it. So I need to get my rifle out. Oh, this is a little bit of a test. Oh boy. Okay. So zero. In. Um, how far is that? We should probably use the binocular first. So that's that target there. So it's for the fifty target. Okay, got it. My rifle back out. So we want to bring that down to 50, which I've now done. Hit the deer! So I, can I zoom in anymore? I can't. Lovely. Hold my breath. Wind. Got a little bit of wind. Ooh! That was a good hit. That would be a good shot. That was a very good hit. Can we zoom in anymore? That's as far as we can zoom. Animal damage systems, injury and bleeding, ethical shooting. So deliver the best shot. Learn the autonomy, I think that was, of the creature. So try and go for its heart. Oh my god, I've been shooting the wrong target. Wow. Trevor wants to keep his shooting skills wow. sharp. Wow. 200 meters? Way too far for a safety shot. So to see extra ballistic information, hold Q. Okay. So you, want me to, you do want me to try and hit the 200 mark, you sure? All right, I'll try. Hit that, I kept hitting the 100 ball, thinking that was 150, I don't know why. Absolute brain dead, I swear. Ooh -hoo -hoo. Like there's a note over there. I'm mean, prone as well, by the way. Damn, I used up a lot of ammo there, complete, complete waste. Hey oh, well. Wallace, don't forget to take care of the badgers wreaking havoc behind the lodge. Sincerely, myself. You forgetful geezer. You forgetful geezer. So we need to hunt down some badgers. Ooh. Enter the hunting stands near the badger 
Okay, so he's going towards the badges. There should be a little... Is that the... Okay, it's here. Ah. So where I should go. So that's uh, a track marker. So I know roughly where to go. It's over there. It's quite a long way. Should I walk or should I get in the car? Should I get in the car? Did it Did it fast travel with me? Um, it didn't fast travel with me. Lovely. <laughs> Fantastic. Oh, that's a nuisance. All right, okay, let's have a quick look at the map. There's a path here. I can fast travel to here, actually. That makes a little bit of sense. So we're closer to the badgers now. Well, right, so I can see. I can see. I've just seen a badger. <gasps> I see badgers. I definitely see badgers. Ooh, okay. So let's go up to this little cabin. Little watchtower. Oh, we do have health as well. Okay. What if the badgers would attack me? True. I don't know. Some of the animations are actually quite good. The reloading, putting the gun away. Pretty nice animations. To, to a, a, good, a good standard. So many burrows. That's unusual. Badges are definitely overpopulated in this area. Oh, yeah, I see them. Yep, yep, yep. They move pretty quick, though. Right, so how far... That's not fast. 50 meters, right? That's about 50 meters, right? Yeah, see? Spot on. I know exactly what I'm doing. This guy stands still. How many do we need to kill? Change my zero in. Once he stops moving, I might have a go. Or do I have a go now? Oh! He's hit. He is not dead. Damn, they definitely had that. <laughs> Subtle as always, Scott. Slight win. Oh, another hit. And how are they just taking these hits? Must be like more of a flesh wound. Oh, that one's dead. That one's definitely dead. Oh. Find the badger, claim it, and harvest it. Harvesting means you can either sell it or attack the dermy the game. Okay. Um. Oh, that is a... Oh, I can see where it went in. Yeah, that's what I thought as well. I thought I hit the rear leg. Okay. Interesting. Should I... Taxidermy yet? I mean, it's my first kill. Yeah, why not? There we go. Analyze. Medium amount of blood. And it's clear. Harvest one badger. Um, use the stand or stand or find them in the field. Okay. Use the stand or even find them in the field. Got it. I have been hearing some walk around me. I can see the blood as well. Ah. So if there's a, a flesh wound, we can potentially try and track them as well. Which I'm actually quite looking forward to. Right, where is another badger? I thought it was a snake then. I see you. Oh, you son of a bitch. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Ah! Oh, I've spotted one about 100 meters away. That's instant, surely. Yeah, it's not moving. And that might be a headshot. <laughs> headshot! Headshots are not always necessarily the best way to kill an animal, of course. A deal shot is working out exactly where the heart is. Boom! Straight into the heart. But I am not professional enough for that. But hopefully we get there. Well, see, one difficulty is trying to work out your, where your queue is. That's how we found it. Claim. Oh, it wasn't the head. Into the, the sort of lungs, I guess. See it travel in? And that is actually quite cool, though, isn't it? Flesh, lungs, left lung, right right lung. See its vitals just drop as well. So we want to... What's that? Plus play? That, like, replay it. 
Has he not replayed the animation? I don't know. Whoa, that's cool. Um, that can we sell that? Does that count as harvesting? Yes, we did it. All right. Oh, I can buy a new rifle. Yes. You don't have to ask me twice. To buy a new rifle, open the store on the computer. If you want to use your new rifle, equip it in the storage. So that's the firearm safe or the car. And you can equip it and you have a new rifle. As good as this rifle's been, it's, it's time to move on. Let's buy a new rifle. If the um, economics and earning money and stuff like that is, is fun to do in this game, that's where I am get quite a lot of interest. Getting those big kills where it gets me lots of money and I can buy that new rifle. Or that, I thought that was, bad, was moving then. That statue, I swear that was moving. <laughs> I swear it was. I had a brief panic. Yeah, and also when I fast travel, I want my car to come back. Because that just seems a bit, a bit stupid, right? What am I going to do now? I'm going to have to walk all the way over there. For no reason whatsoever. That's kind of stupid. Alright, use the computer. So this is about the disease that's spreading. I'm not quite sure what this means. Um, another person has been hop, ho hospitalized under suspicion, suspicious conditions after consuming some deer meat. Okay. I'm sure it's nothing. Don't contact my son. I think the subject says it all. Your cruel hobby devastated wife and I don't want to see the same thing happen to my son. He has had his own life and career out in LA. He's only helping you out of pity and the emotional blackmail. Don't bother him with your business or contact him ever again. Oh. Not quite friendly, is it? Is he at the moment? It's not, not friendly at all. Look all the rifles we can get. Oh, shotguns as well. Mmm. Attachments. Extra gear. What's that? Oh, an elk call. What? I can call for them? Yes. There's loads of them. A goose call. Okay, I'm looking forward to this. That's cool. Loads of different attachments. Lovely. Is this boundaries? Does this expand the map? Really? Well, that's interesting. Anyway, uh, let's buy this rifle. The Remington 783. For 1,000 coins. So I believe the hunting tier for Grandpa's rifle was four. So it is a slight increase. Um, let's see if we can equip it. Equip. Can I use the same scope? I can. I'd love a secondary rifle. I can actually take Grandpa's rifle with me if I want to. Um, the, the mag clip is smaller. Uh, it does take... Does it take the same rounds? No, it doesn't. It takes different uh, rounds. I shouldn't use this bad boy for more than 100 meters. Okay. Reach the upper grassland area. Ooh. Always try to aim at the vital organs to kill quickly and painlessly as possible. The hunting tier of the firearm will help you decide if it's an ideal... Okay. So certain rifles are ideal for certain situations. Which I guess we knew already. Uh, let's head out. So where are we going now? Ooh. Um, you can set up markers, which we've already done. And here's my new rifle. Very nice. Can't wait to use it. So did he say don't use this rifle unless it's over 100 meters? Is that what he said? I think that's what he said. I'm going to have to watch that back. So yeah, certain weapons for certain ranges. Again, that's where it's probably quite a good idea to have multiple weapons. Maybe I should have brought grandpa's rifle with me oops map feels pretty sizable it looks like it sounds like there might be yeah so there's different areas to go to another cabin over there yeah definitely the, 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 the map's gonna expand no doubt about that so if you guys want me to do oh 
Never walk across a fire range. <laughs> that is a terrible idea. Uh, but yeah, if you guys want me to do a part two, let me know with a collect, with the comments below. Any advice on hunting and things like that, I'm all ears. As you can probably tell, I'm very naive. I come from the UK. I don't do much hunting. Never done hunting, actually. Have I ever used a weapon? No. Unless you, unless you count a paintball gun as a weapon. I don't believe I have. So, yes. Apart from being in-game with a weapon, that's, that's, that's probably the nearest I've ever got to it. I'm being completely honest. This is a fair old stroll. Again, I don't know why the car didn't fast travel with me. Uh, why did the game make me do that? And I can't fast travel back to Echo. What was that? Ooh. Pew! No, I'm not quite ready for that yet. What? What bird is that? Absolutely no idea. Oh, hello. Ah. Oh. We're just going to stay still. Damn you. Oh, well. Right, so I've got 400 meters to go. Obviously, while it's early in the game, I don't really mind running around. But of course, normally... Ah, oh, what's that little cabin over there? Better stay low. Move quietly. Don't spook the animals. animals from behind cover. So we've run into that little thing just there. Ah, so we want a mule deer. I remember when I couldn't tell the difference between a white-tailed deer and a mule deer. Or a white-tailed deer. Remember, used to tease me about it. Is there one there, actually? I think I might have spooked him. Let's see if I haven't forgotten all those hunting lessons from Grandpa. Alarmed animals. You've spooked the animals. I was quite far away there, and they were spooked. I mean, I was absolutely sprinting, but still. What the hell is that? I feel completely out of my natural habitat right now. Feeling we're not going to see much. Those deers have gone. Absolutely vamoosed. You see them? We're quite up high here. So we're in the right area. Yeah, just about. We're on the very edge. Oh, that's quite far away, isn't it? That's very far away. Yeah, I don't think I can reach, but that is a lot of deer. Is it definitely the right deer? I'll be completely honest. I have no idea. Should I, have, should I go for a shot here? I'm going to regret this, aren't I? I'm going to embarrass myself. So obviously zero in as far as possible. Oh, okay. Okay. Now we're talking. Now we're talking. That's as far as I can zoom in. Ooh. That's hard. When you're in the moment. Oh, shoot. And they're hopping away. <laughs> oh no! What have I done? Completely spooked him. Shoot. He just breathed out at the completely wrong moment there. Oh. Ah. I was trying to go for a good shot. So annoying. Oh. Poxy deer. So far away. I need to be patient as well. This is not Call of Duty. Can I swim? Find out. Yep. Definitely slower. Right, let's try and get within 300 to 200 meters. I do like how it does feel like I am in the middle of the wilderness. It does feel like I'm in a bit of nowhere. The sounds are really good. Creatures, insects. So this is where they were. Obviously not here anymore. It was quite a long shot, but... Yeah, the timing was not great. Ugh. <sighs>
I like how I'm still running. Probably not the best idea. Let's go for a slight walk. Because they could be over this. They're still going to be quite far away, but they might be within the shooting range. Where are you? Don't see him yet. Where are you, dear? Damn, I can't even... Is that one there? Did I see movement, or was that a leaf? Ah, oh, damn it. I thought that was a deer. Oh! Okay, so 400 metres away. Gee! Don't know if that's going to be possible for me. I'm lacking a bit of scope. That's as far as I can zoom in. That is not far enough. Oh. Do you move? Try another shot. Damn it. He heard, heard that one. No. I'm doing so bad. Oh, I need to be more patient. Oh. Found the bridge. Oh, man. Are they still running? You've got to be kidding me. Did I spook him again? I'm really far away over here. Like, really far away. Ah! I wasn't sprinting either. I was walking in a pleasant fashion. Yeah, that's where they've gone. Ah. They must. I guess they're almost on, like, a high alert. They've heard gunshots. They're, they're on the lookout, basically. Shoot. Yeah, they're going up there. I've been walking for ages. I didn't realise hunting was so much hard work. Well, it is when you keep missing, I guess. If you nailed the hit the first time, it wouldn't be too bad. Well, this is like my third go. Oh, one sec. I think I just seen a deer. How actually how far is it? Let's go prone. Whoop. There it is. What did it say? 200 meters away ish okay, this might be a good uh, a good opportunity all right zero in at 200 still very far away from me it's not a great view you can't zoom any okay great all right got it definitely got it there it is it's moving slow Definitely hit it. Where's it going? Ah. All right. Is it dead? That's the question. I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. I got no idea. Should I go to where I hit it and try and follow its blood trail? Definitely got a hit. Just not sure where exactly on the body I did hit. Game is fun. <laughs> it's quite addictive. Like I really want to get better as well. That's that's definitely something I want to. If I was nailing it straight away, it'd almost be a bit easier. And be like, okay, let's go and hunt the bear now. Clearly, when I'm not not ready to go and hunt for a bear just yet. If bears are even in this game, I'm trying to see if we can spot any blood. Okay, so apparently white deer often drink here, apparently. Hmm. Is it worth going up to that little tower thing over there and just waiting? Maybe that's a good idea. 
and then just hoping they turn up. I mean, that's got to be a strategy, right? Only issue is, I, if they run, if it's not a clean kill, I can have no idea where they're going. And whether they're even dead or not. Would you look at that? Okay. Would you look at that? So being a bit more patient is probably more advisable. Just sitting down in one of these like stands and just waiting. Still quite far away though. 300 meters. Okay, if I miss, they're off. They are off in a hurry. I could zoom in a bit more. So useful. <laughs> Definitely got one. Come on, man. Let me just hop away. So patronizing. That one's definitely wounded. 100%. No? Like, surely. That was 100% wounded. I so badly wanted to end this episode with a deer. And I just, I just for the life of me, cannot find that deer. So aggravating. These tracks are stupid, by the way. Oh, great. I know a deer's been through here at one point. And they go in every different direction possible. I guess I'm not a natural hunter. I don't know. If I'm missing anything, though, please let me know in the comments. And we'll bring it into the next video. Um, I feel like I've tried everything. I don't know. I feel like I've tried absolutely everything. Stuff you haven't seen in the video. I've tried looking for blood absolutely everywhere. I've tried looking for tracks. Found a bit of a technique where we can sort of stay still, uh, find predictable locations. That's been useful, but also surprised I haven't had a clean kill yet. I feel like I've, my, my shots haven't been too bad. Um, yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys still enjoyed it. Hopefully if we do a part two, we can actually find a deer. That'd be crazy, wouldn't it? Wow, I've got skill points as well. Is that skill points? I believe so. Yeah. Thank you guys for watching. Hope you guys enjoyed this episode. And I will see you guys very soon. Bye-bye.